Amphibians as bioindicators. How important are they? Across the world, amphibians are used as environmental bioindicators to determine the health of the waterways and or the land they inhabit. This investigation explores the concept of whether amphibians will be missed if their demise continued at the alarming rate that is currently occurring. Amphibians form a class of animal more commonly known as frogs, toads, newts, salamanders and sicilians. They are generally either loved or met with a feeling of slimy disdain. Fortunately, this investigation created a certain fondness for our amphibian friends. It was incredibly surprising to discover just how crucial amphibians are to not only the sustainable future of the Earth, but also the general health and well-being of humans. On the other hand, it was not surprising to discover that ironically the same humans amphibians help are the main factor in the demise of healthy amphibian populations. Pollution habitat destruction, poisoning and overcapture are just a few of the human source factors of amphibian loss. Due to amphibian sensitive status, they are ideal to provide an early warning of declining ecosystem health and also diagnostic information. As amphibians inhabit both land and water, they are considered an indicator of the health of the entire ecosystem as they are exposed to minute changes in temperature, rainfall and UV radiation. Amphibians also inhabit the zone where they were hatched and tend to live their lives in this area, so are excellent bioindicators on a local scale. It was horrifying to learn that after 250 million years on this earth, a third of all amphibians are now extinct. This is of great significance as amphibians form an integral link in the ecological food chain. In the animal kingdom, amphibians provide food for snakes, birds and lizards. Fish and dragonfly nymphs consume the tadpoles, while spiders and wasps eat amphibian eggs. Streams with algae blooms are evidence of the loss of tadpoles. Their disappearance affects plant growth as they are no longer present, producing nitrogen. Furthermore, salamanders in particular have been reported as possibly slowing the process of global warming by eating the insects that break down leaf litter, thereby slowing the decay which sequesters carbon. Amphibians further tackle the issue of global warming by providing a method of creating a fossil fuel 10 times faster than plant-based methods via the foam produced in the tiny Tungara frog's nest. If these reasons alone are not enough to convince viewers that amphibians are crucial to our world, then consider the contributions they make to humankind directly. The discovery of the amino acid compound peptide has produced great possibilities and advances in human medicine the production of antibiotics from the skin of an Australian tree amphibian that kill bacteria resistant to conventional antibiotics is one of particular interest. The possibilities are numerous. From one amphibian, a peptide is produced that has four known effects. Slows down the production of cancer cells, viral infection of target cells, destroys nematodes, and is resistant to the malaria parasite. Following from this, the dart from the poison dart amphibian produces an analgesic that is considered to be up to 200 times more potent than morphine. The secretion of one species of amphibian has even shown promise in relation to shoulder cuff repair. There is no possible way to ignore the significant contributions amphibians make not only to humankind but to the Earth's sustainability. Either way, the existence of frogs as bioindicators or contributors to human medical research and health should be enough to convince people of their importance. It seems only just, considering the human race's involvement in amphibian demise, that the plight of the worldwide amphibian population has more time and energy dedicated to it. As a member of your community, join one of your local amphibian surveying, frog monitoring or recovery groups. It is from the grassroots level that we can start to give back to our amphibian friends the habitat they require to survive and thrive as incredibly crucial members of our ecosystem.